So the Xbox One will not have any sort of backward compatibility with Xbox 360 games. You sons of but before we get to this video, let's get to the question of the day. Alright, so stay tuned to the end of this video to find out the answer to the question of the day. Okay, so basically the Xbox business head Don Matrick says that only about 5% of actual gamers play past generation games on the current new systems. Okay, apparently that's what Microsoft believes in and perhaps this is uh, their justification of not having uh, BC in the Xbox One. Of course, I'm very much against not having BC because if, uh, let me explain to um, any retard out there that has no idea why uh, not having BC is the dumbest fucking thing. Um, let me explain exactly the most obvious reason. Xbox One is a brand new system. And it's supposed to be sturdy, it's supposed to be reliable, and hopefully, I'm assuming, that because it's a brand new system, Microsoft, it's, it's gonna be a, a quality system, and Microsoft has taken their time to perfect this fucking console. It's going to be a lot more reliable than a fucking Red Ring of Death 360. That it functions functions better. It works better. It doesn't fuck up after three hours of use, after an hour of use, after uh, overheating. It doesn't have any overheating issues, or at least co compared to the fucking 360. I mean, even the you know the 360 Slim has its problems. It still has risks of the Red Ring, or not even the Red Ring. It, Technically, can't, can't get it, but it still fucks up. Um, the main reason I was looking forward to the Xbox One having BC is so I can play my 360 titles on it and not have any risks of getting fucking red ringed. Jesus, man. So, and this bullshit about 5%? Are you fucking kidding me? 5%. I mean, how many people actually play BC? How many people play PS1 games on their PS2, if not their PS3? How many people play Game Boy games on their DS? How many play? How many people play GBA games on their DS? What about the 3DS? Doesn't the 3DS have BC with fucking DS games? Or how about the Wii U? Doesn't the Wii U have BC2 with fucking Wii games? I mean, I, I, I don't know. I mean, I, I, my god. These new systems that are coming out are not featuring BC anymore, backward compatibility, less they have no, no BC. That I, I'm starting to forget what BC is all about. I'm, I'm actually fucking, it's leaving my memory. It's becoming extinct, a fucking thing of the past. I can't believe that this function, this mode of of convenience this thing that we got back in the 90s even in the fucking 80s with the Atari systems this is not new technology and all of a sudden they're leaving it they're leaving it they're actually abandoning this fucking once convenient once available and yes once entitlement we are we should be fucking entitled to get this shit because this is basic technology, isn't it? I mean, isn't it the easiest thing to actually let the systems play older games? Oh my god, why is it so hard now? Why is it so difficult? Why, why, why? Oh my god. Uh, oh, I, I love this guy's comment. You know, he basically said, If you're backwards compatible, you're really backwards. Really. That's what this dumbass said. You're backwards if you have BC? What kind of shitty logic is that? That doesn't even make any sense. That's not even... I, I mean, how retarded can you be? I mean, holy fuck. You're really backwards. So, a system is regressing 
and stuck in the past, I guess, is what you're implying. If it has backward compatibility, if it has a function, an ability to play older games. Thus, allowing access to a wider range and library of fucking games. A massive library that the 360 has at its disposal. And you're, you're not going to allow the Xbox One, this new upcoming system, to actually have access to that? Oh my god! Let me explain what it all boils down to. It's because of the fucking money, okay? I understand this whole, okay, not being able to read and not having the... It's, it's a different engine or whatever, so it doesn't like read it properly. Okay, maybe they can sort of skirt around that issue and be like, well, it's a completely brand new system with a new engine and, you know, new processing and everything. Like, the way it reads discs is different and all that bull fucking shit. Okay, okay. But the main reason why is because of the money. Microsoft wants to whore out these games if they ever want to release it on, on DLC or the way that the PS4 is supposedly going to use the whole, uh... I don't know, Steam thing or whatever the fuck they're doing where you can download or uh, cloud stream these games um, from past generations. I wouldn't be surprised if Xbox One has it as well if Microsoft does this with their uh, older games. And now instead you're going to have to pay for these games all, all over again, re-buy them, re-download them from the store and then store it in your uh, hard drive on the Xbox One. I, I mean, they try to justify this, and I understand, obviously, not everybody plays backward compatible games. I, I get it. Um, and some people are sort of stuck in their own generation. Like, I'll admit, I don't play a lot of PS1 games on my PS2, because I don't even own that many. I sold all of my old PS1 games, because I, I just don't like... Anything from the 90s that's like 3D, I just, I can't get into it again, you know what I mean? That sort of N64, PS1, Sega Saturn era of, of 3D games, they're way too old, polygonal bullshit to me. Like, I just can't look at them, I can't bear it. So I sort of stick with the PS2 on the PS2 system. But, it's nice having that fucking option. There are still some games here and there on the PS1 that I can at least play on the PS2, like games like Castlevania... Symphony of the Night, you know, certain titles like that. You know, maybe even Tekken 3, you know, something like that. Uh, maybe one of the RPGs on there. Fucking Vagrant Story, I don't know. You know? Chrono Cross? <sighs> it's, it's just great. So, like, I don't have to buy a PS1. I don't have to buy the older system. But I guess that's just the way it is. I mean, I think that in by 2030, 2050, they're not even going to have BC. Like, and it might stretch to everything else. I mean, Jesus Christ, what's next? Uh, laptop. You know, you're not going to be able to play uh, Diablo 3 on Windows 20. You know, like, Jesus. Because, oh, it just it can't read it anymore. Because, uh... It's, it's, you're going backwards. Don't play old games, play new games, idiot. Oh my god, you fucking pricks. Alright, so this was the answer to the question of the day.